Yes, I'm uh, originally from a small town in Nebraska, uh, Dakin, Nebraska, and I'm a, currently a student at the University of Nebraska in Lincoln. I'm a, I'm, I'm a little bit nervous. I, I'm excited, actually. I would probably say my parents are uh, much more nervous than I am, So, uh, but this is something uh, that I feel is important and I feel it's worthwhile. So uh, I'm looking forward to the movement, to the experience. It's my first time in D.C. and I'm really excited, really happy that um, I'm coming here with a purpose and uh, that there's a reason for me being here. You know, we're, we're passionate about protecting our resources. The Ogallala Aquifer, Aquifer specifically in Nebraska, is something that's very important to our state. And we feel like uh, TransCanada is coming through and um, really taking advantage of uh, small landowners, small farmers who may not have the resources to fight back. You know, well, in Nebraska, our uh, campaign has kind of focused um, around um, a, a landowner in Nebraska, Randy. He started off single-handedly fighting TransCanada. They threatened him. They did, um, they did everything they could, and he stood tall. Through his inspiration, we've really been able to grow um, support throughout the state. This is about our heritage, and this is about our land and our water. I'm here because I feel like whatever risk uh, of getting arrested may pose is, far, uh, is not near as great as the risk of the pipeline going through our country.